Hello everybody, pumpkin flowers for my recipe right here as you can see them. They look real nice. The pumpkin. Today I'm going to be making a pumpkin flowers uh, recipe and I'm going to start with the ingredients. For starting we have our flowers right here and um, I open them so I can rinse them in cold water and we have them right here. And over here I have three roasted um, jalapenos that I'm going to be using, two garlics, uh, one medium onion, one teaspoon of salt. And I have the cheese over here, it's uh, cheese Oaxaca as you can see. And it comes like in a bowl like this, so I'm going to shred it. And over here I have the maseca that I'm going to be using. It's going to be four cups and I'm going to be using three cups of warm water. I might need more, I don't know. And one teaspoon of salt and the machine that I'm going to be using for the tortillas. Okay, so I'm going to start. Okay, and I start by cutting the, the flowers and I have like this and make it a little smaller. Take this out. So I'm going to cut all the flowers first, okay? So I already cut the flowers. So I'm going to start with the cheese. And this is what I do. Okay, I'm done with the cheese. So, so now I'm going to remove this from the jalapenos. And I'm going to remove the seeds. And then we uh, cook the, the pumpkin flowers and then we do the masa, okay? Here, we're going to cut it in small pieces, something like this. This is my jalapeno. So now I, I'm going to start uh, cooking the pumpkin flowers. So I'm going to start with the olive oil. I'm going to put probably like uh, two tablespoons right there. And I'm going to put the onion, garlic, and the salt. We fry it a little bit and then we're going to put the, the pumpkin flowers in here. Let me put the salt now that it's cooking. Okay, time for the flowers. So we're going to put them in here. Okay, now we cover. And put the fire in low, okay? So the flowers are cooking over here. So now we're going to start preparing the masa. Okay, so now I'm going to start making the masa here. So I'm going to put the salt. And I'm going to start with two cups of water. And this is warm water. Not too hot, not too cold. And this is the third one. And we'll see if we need more water, okay? So I'm going to start mixing here. So I'm going to put probably another cup of water, little by little. So I'm going to be mixing this for a while. So far I put four cups of water. And this is um, four cups of uh, maseca. 
Okay, I'm going to put a little more water. In less than one fourth of a cup. And the masa is ready. So I'm going to put water here on the side because we're going to be using it later. So put that one on the side. So the masa is ready. So we're going to check on the, on the pumpkin flowers. And we got our flowers here cooking. And we can check for salt in here. Yeah, it's good. And I'm gonna put the jalapeno here now. It and it's uh, a more time frying in here, so we're gonna leave it cooking for a little more. Okay, it's already done, so I'm gonna turn it off. We're gonna start making our tortillas for for the quesadillas. So I'm going to turn it off. So we're going to start by doing a normal tortilla. Right here. And if you don't have a machine, you can always use the, the cutting board. So here's our tortilla. Right there, that's the first one. Okay, so now we're gonna do the first turn. And right here, I'm gonna be putting the filling. So I put flour. put a lot and the cheese right there let's check if it's ready to fold wait a little bit and then we're gonna fold it okay okay now I'm gonna fold it oops right there and I'm going to put the other tortilla here. Right here. So let's turn the tortilla here. And this one is already done. I'm going to show it to you. You see how it looks? So we're going to put it to the side. And we're going to be putting everything over here on this one. And the cheese. Let it cook on the, on the other side and then we fold it. Okay, it's time to fold it. So we fold it like this. And put it to the side. And let's put another tortilla here. I'm going to turn the quesadilla on the other side. Right there. Okay, this one is already done. So we're going to do another one. So now the cheese. And let it cook for a little while. Ready for the folding, so put it to the side. This is the finished product. I hope you like the recipe and thank you for watching my videos. Like and subscribe.